Hello everyone, good evening, and welcome to our concert. If you didn't have energy yet, you're going to, because these kids are so excited to be here. Before we get started, I want to take uh, just a moment to pass the mic to one of our Orchestra Parent Association uh, board members. This is Mrs. Hall, who's going to share a few words with you from the Monshores Orchestra Parents Association. Good evening. On behalf of the Monshores Parent, uh, Monshores Orchestra Parents Association, we'd like to welcome you to the fifth and sixth grade concert tonight. Um, my name is Laura Hall. Um, my daughter Ellie joined orchestra as a fifth grader, and she's now in sixth grade orchestra in Middle Fiddles. And it's been so cool to watch her go from learning how to play music last year to playing phenomenal music this year and really find a deep passion for music. Um, before they get started tonight, the MSOPA wanted to um, see if you would consider donating to their own fundraiser. The MSOPA funds um, uh, the orchestra programs from 5th to 12th grade throughout the district. And the money provided helps pay for the music, supplemental instruction, activities for the kids, and scholarships for the summer and the summer camps and lessons. <coughs> um, so if you consider donating, that'd be great. You can donate any time. There is a QR code on your program, or you can go to www.monashoresorchestra.org. You can donate any time. Um, the MSOP would also like to invite you to get involved. We will have a meeting tomorrow, um, Wednesday, April 17th at 7 p.m. and they meet at the high school in the orchestra room. And we're just a bunch of parents like myself and we'd love to see you there. Um, you're also welcome to join the Mona Shores Orchestra Association Facebook page, which is a great way to stay informed, but they also post some fun pictures and videos there too. And lastly, I'd like to thank Mr. Rose and Mr. Mosley for their dedication in educating our students. I'm blown away at how many hours they put into this and how hard they work and how much they love the students. So many thanks to them and thanks to all of you for supporting the orchestra program. So the sixth grade orchestra has been working very hard for this concert. They are very excited for the music they're going to present to you. Um, I will tell you the titles because the uh, fifth graders don't have programs in their hands, do you? So the name of the first song that they're going to play is called Sword Dance. Hi, my name is Lana Cameron. I want to start off by saying that when I was in fifth grade and trying to decide 
If I want to do a band or orchestra, I stress myself out thinking about it every day. Until my fifth grade teacher, Miss Man, Mandy, said, If you love playing cello, why do you? I thank her every day for saying that, because now I get to enjoy all the wonderful things that come from me during orchestra. The cupcakes, Mr. Mose and the Misty Rose. How they teach? Mr. Mose is fun and not fun. And best of all, playing music with my friends, sharing laughs with my classmates, and doing something I love every day. Hi, my name is Jayla Alvarado. I picked orchestra because it is a fun class and an easy grade if you pay attention. We have great beloved teachers. Mrs. D. Rose and Mr. Mosley. They will help you with anything you need, such as tuning and to rise in your bow. Orchestra gets better in middle school because you have it every day in awesome concerts, and even sometimes we play with the high school orchestra. You get to be in a class with all your friends from sixth grade orchestra. It is probably one of the best options to do out of all three of the music choices. You get to learn how to make beautiful music and play in front of family and friends. I really hope all of the fifth graders choose this wonderful opportunity. The next song is called Team She's Stone Army. Cupcakes on your birthday from Mr. Malty. It's the best hour of my day. It's the one thing I look forward to every day. 
Over the last two years, I've played over dozens of them. I just love their chairs. Orchestra makes me feel happy. Besides, nothing beats playing those at the North Pole, swaying and blowing a beautiful time. So as I finish, I'll say, try six to your orchestra. May it be the best part of your day, too. Do you like orchestra? I guarantee you will love it in sixth grade. What do you, what's that you say? You want to know why it's great? Well, to start, you have to get up early in fifth grade. Like half an hour early, which is really annoying because you want to get your sleep, right? Well, in sixth grade, no more waking you up early because now orchestra is part of school. Well, that's great, but what else is there you're probably thinking? Well, during the month of your birthday, you and everyone else who has a birthday during that month gets an ultra special, delicious, and hand baked. Mr. Mosley Cupcake to eat during class. <laughs> also, I like that you play better sounding and funner songs. I joined orchestra because my older sister joined and I wanted to be like her. But you can join because it's fun, the teachers are great, or you want to try something new. Those are the reasons why I joined and like orchestra. I hope you join too. I can't wait to hear you guys play. The next song is called Viking Ships of Old.
you you go from only being able to play a scale to playing things you never think you would be able to play. You also get cupcakes on your birthday. You might even make new friends. And if you already have friends at Dr. Shrug, you get to see them every day. You also learn so many new things. You can explore new options outside of orchestra, like camps at the Blue Lake Fine Arts Camp or summer camp. Well, all in all, orchestra is really fun. I really hope you try to do it again. Orchestra is so much fun, and if I'm being honest, the songs, the songs only get harder. But the more you practice, the easier it gets. There are so many fun songs you can learn and play. The reason I joined 6th grade orchestra is because I found 5th grade orchestra really fun, and I hope you do too. I also joined because when I found out you could do it in 6th grade, I was so happy. I hope you join the 6th grade orchestra too. The sixth graders' final song, I think it's probably your, their favorite, would you agree? Oh, yeah. This is called Dragon Hunter.
stage now, we have what we call the middle fiddles because it's the middle school version of the fiddlers. We have six graders. Six graders, raise your hands. Six graders on stage, raise your hands. They're the ones in the blue shirts. And we have seventh graders. Seventh graders, raise your hands. And we have eighth graders. This is their last little fiddles performance. They're moving on to the big leagues next year. So we'd like to play a few different tunes for you. First, we're going to put together two uh, songs called, um, what are they called? Called The Butterfly and Swallowtail Jig. Devil's Dream 
And I don't know what's going to happen, because I was just told, they were all warming up backstage, and uh, they said, just go with the flow on that one's dream, so we'll see what happens.
Lauren Dewey holds her out of the ice cream. That just broke in the middle of that song. Go, oh, Lauren. We have one more that we'd like to play for you. This is called The Silver Spear. And we're going to open up the soloist mic to anyone that wants to come up and play a solo. Alright? You know what to do. My attention. Alright?
Thank you so much. Thank you, Middle Fiddles. You may go to your various places. Fifth graders, are you ready? So, very carefully, we don't want any instruments to get bumped. Let's do shallows and bases first.
I think they're all set now for the fifth graders. We're going to pick up sort of where we left off in the book from our last concert. So we're going to take you on the journey that we've been on since December, learning some new things. The first song we actually want to play for you is kind of a warm-up, too. This is the D major scale.
is a leg throw or a fast. We're going to try Preston. so far. Next we're going to turn to the next page if you didn't already. We're looking for number 86, Ode to Joy. This combines half notes, quarter notes, eight notes, a whole bunch of stuff we've learned up to this point. Thank you. 
enter into an American fiddle tune that features our bass section. They've got this awesome technique they can do, pluck slap, that just sounds so awesome. So you're going to hear this one one time with just the basses, and then everybody's going to join and play two more times. This is called Loyal and Cabbage Down.
We have just one more song for you, and this is our big grand finale. So sixth graders, if you would make your way to your places, please. Sixth graders, don't forget about your binders over here in the 